You're stinky. And I'm hot. Mm. Oh my god. I may be a chunky bird, but I'm still hot. I'll take it. Remember when I said we would improvise? <laughs> Now's the time. We don't need a whole prototype. The components in this box will tell us all we need to know. And look oh around. God. What the f Some of these parts are far too big for the weapon I saw. The dredge must be planning to build an even larger version. With a weapon that size, they could yeah. shoot through a small mountain. With you that a size. Building, a building what? makes more sense. The dredge stole a book about ancient architecture from the priory. They must be preparing to take out a large structure. Well spotted. This weaponsmith, Vyasheslav, sounds madder all the time, even for a dredge. Let's take what we've learned back to the others and figure out where the dredge will strike. Why are you so big? We're doing Snowden Drifts. At the very least, I wanna do the five, uh, five hero challenges. And I think we're somewhere around here. Let's TP. It's fifty dollars. I know it's expensive. It's very expensive. The intuition of me. Um, um, okay. I don't see any hero challenges. That's that's great. Okay, change of plans. Uh, we are going to this waypoint and we'll travel south through Vilmark foothills. This will probably be a, uh, a short stream. I think I'll mostly do the hero challenges here. Hit level 30 and do, and do the story. Which actually is kind of a lot, but whatever. <laughs> yeah, it is, it is expensive. <sighs> Ellie, I'm not stinky. I'm not. Oh my god, Ellie's streaming herself. What is she streaming? Oh boy! Oh duck duck, okay. I don't have my tools? Oh. Oh, I messed up. Whatever. Not Raptor, right? I don't think so. Paranoid. Yee. Party. Uh, I want to grab the Vista. Where is it? How do I get to it? Was there a scalp? Yeah, there was. Yeah. Uh, uh. Yeah. Yeah. I got it. How long? I'm not sure. I want to finish the set, the third part of the story. Once I'm done with it, I will end. We. I want to complete the hero challenges on this map, and I will definitely hit level thirty by then. And I'll just do the story. I suspect around two hours. But I, I'm not sure. Um, there is one hero challenge up ahead. Like the owl shaman as she purifies snow owls. Oh, that is the owl lodge, right? Kind of forgot about that. I deal a lot of damage. That's nice. The event is almost done. Six out of eight. Hello, Joko. 
Hello. Why is this alive? I mean, uh, I don't know. I'm back. Hi. Hello. Yeah, I saw that I was streaming. I saw that. I was trying to, re to render m uh, the first stream and I failed miserably. I wasted like, I don't know, three hours on that. Unlucky. Skill issue. Tag. Why is there a chunky burp streaming? Who are you calling chunky, huh? Huh? I have no idea what you're talking about. Hey. Oh, there's a there's a second part of this. Ooh. <laughs> Twenty uh, oh twenty nine. Okay, we need one more. Thank you, Ellie. Thank you. Dragon hmm. totem. Where is huh? I'm so we. What did I do though? Heart. Can I only make out a few lines and uh, and and owl said to wolf brother all your hunting is for naught if your family dines alone and wolf returned to his cubs for he knew that the owl was wise yeah owl was well knowledge obviously and she she got corrupted by uh, by Jormag the ice dragon Oh god, oh god, uh, I don't wanna die. It's the hero, hero challenge, it's... Oh, it's there. Devotee of the owl. Interesting. Let's get a gl glyph of storms. You will be able to create uh, some fire storm 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 storms. Yeah, some storm storms. Ellie just called me stinky. Few remain who still teach the ways of Owl, and yet her methods are extra extraordinary. Hunting at night with ambush -like swiftness and precision. It's beautiful to behold. Shall I show you? Yep, sure. One done. Uh, four more to go. And there's a level 80 raven here. Interesting. Hmm. It's so cold. I mean, it is the far north. Actually, it's not even north. It's like a middle of the map. <laughs> but yeah, it's the cold area. We are Norn after all. Is there an easy way to get to this vista through here?
there and jump me? Yeah, Jormak eliminated uh, the owl spirit. Will it work? All right, I have a glider. But I think that this was the correct way to do it. But we should go through here. Yeah, I have to delete it. I mean, I am supposed to have a new video out, but I just couldn't render it. I'm having big, big technical issues. I really wanted to come back from work, render it, upload it, and stream. And it was supposed to be done, like, two hours ago. And I got nothing done. I don't know, it's super annoying and I hate it. Um... Okay, let's go this way. Okay, to speed things up, I think I'll just skip Vistas and Hearts, and I'll literally just look for the... Um, for the uh, hero challenges. See what's stinky? It was super stinky. And I, I just hope it's not broken. Raptor will take a look at it soon-ish. Maybe Thursday, maybe not, I don't know. Okay, nothing. Hello? Well, what? Raptor! Right. Gaki, baby. You're a cat boy! You have a tail. Oh, that is cute. Oh. Yeah. That's true, Jacko. Yeah, I'm, do I'm doing the PNG tuber mostly because I want to stream after work and I just don't have enough time to... to like, get ready. Visually. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. Why is he hitting me? Okay, the POI, but... Um, okay, I don't really want him to die. But he is a ranger, like, rangers cannot die in an open world. Almost impossible. VTuber like Ellie? Nah, that, it's too much work. Uh, I, I don't really care for like all the effects that Ellie does. She enjoys it, I wouldn't. I never really wanted a VTuber. Why am I not taking a road? Like, th there are, like, way less enemies on the roads. I'm gonna fly away. Hero points, I've done this one. There should be one in this area, I think. I lied. I'll just grab the, the waypoint then. Oh. Oh, it's the woman. I mean, you have mounts. I don't. 
Uh, so little help. I mean, I am only level 30. Do you mean the enemies or, or what? Because if, if you mean the enemies, I am slightly um, over leveled to them. There is scaling, but if you, if you have higher level, you're always stronger. Uh, I'm going to have to be there and discover the left. My, the character is a newbie. I used to play Guild Wars a lot, but I recently came back after like four years of absence. Up will find me. Don't have to wait for him. I could just add him to my party, but I, I think he just wants to stalk me without being in my party. If he wanted to, he could always invite me. I'm the newbie, yay! There's a there's a next zone. Hmm. Hello. So Okay, Ichika, thank you for the one gifted. I'm not even gonna say who it went to. Um yeah. That's some great RNG. That is a person that um followed yesterday off stream. And I'm pretty sure it's someone from my work. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. I, yeah. Also, that was extremely loud for me. The gifted sound. I mean, they got the notification, thanks to you. Listen, you could have chosen someone, and you didn't. It's on you. If anything happens, it's on you. Uh, oh, my dagger is stuck. Alright. Ink for hero challenges. Still nothing. Are you serious? Oof. Running, running like a headless chicken. I am looking for hero challenges. Let's and. Uh, Has to be something here, right? Dredge tunnels. There's no one else here? Like, in game or where? Let's open the wiki. I'm not gonna. Uh, um, I guess we could kill the guy. But he's running away. Why is he running away? Wait. Quick event. We are level 30. So now all I need uh, are the events. Uh, we got invited to a dungeon, which we are gonna do after the uh, after the next story arc. Am I? I've never been in this particular tunnel. Oh. So yeah, we'll do a dungeon, but we'll need a group and. All we have is Raptor and possibly Ellie, but I'll have to turn it out. Okay, where are those freaking hero challenges? Like, I've discovered so much and there are still four more on the map. Like, what? Here? Here's one. Ah, uh, yes. Oh. 
and Sage and Morton. Yeah. Wait, Sage, Morton, Raptor, L. Yeah, that's five. Perfect. So yeah, the, the, the dungeons in this game, they explore the story of Aristagalkin's guild. So like, every race has their own, let's say, champion like Air. And we'll explore uh, their story. An invisible blanket of magical energy hangs thick around the totem, filling those near it with feelings of confidence and power. It appears as if the girl actually found a mystical artifact. That's just a bunch of stones. And I kinda see a fat woman here. Yeah. Another veteran. Oh. Yes, Ichoko, especially the story mode. Because th there's there are like explorer paths and story mode, and the story mode has actual lore. Is hearing voices. Uh. Okay, so that's the southernmost part, so everything else has to be in, in this part, right? I think. You also pew pew things in the dungeons. You, you, you do that. Absolutely. But if I'm doing the full story playthrough, dungeons are a part of it. And they are fun. And thankfully, in this game, they are still a challenge. Oh, that's not Raptor. Where is Raptor? Here's Raptor. One. By Raven, there's no end to Tyria. The waypoints. I mean, it checker, you could, you know, return. It's fun, they added a lot of stuff. Game's great. Wait. Oh, it's here, okay. I thought it was, uh, like, on the ground for a second. Huh? Why are there three weapons on each other? Yeah, exactly, like, th three weapons so close to one another. A node in the nest reads, beware, the residence... God damn it, Raptor. He did it on purpose, I swear. The last waypoint here. For some reason, this place is being attacked by my centaurs. Surely we don't care about that, right? You don't have to help the people. They're probably already dead.
Three? I think it's actually four years. Okay, so that's the center encampment, and there's a hero point. And I'm being attacked by a veteran sage. Okay. Have anyone here? I don't know where after is. I don't see him. I don't know where. I think I'll just ignore it. I mean, it's everything is still relevant. It's not like in World of Warcraft or other MMOs. Oh, here. To explore everything. They actually added more story, because there used to be a story that was not accessible for players, which is season one. But now it's back, and you can play the game in its entirety. Finally. Meteors. So the blue bar now it's a red bar, but it's it's a mechanic that appears later on, especially with like more difficult enemies. And what you basically need to do now it will be blue. You need to use CC to stun them. Vulnerable while, while broken. So I'm gonna use an uh, an immobilize ability, and it will go down. Boom. Some cripple. I will blind him. I will stun him, and it's broken. It's so cool, because the combat in this game is very, it's seemingly very easy, very straightforward, and anyone can actually do it. But there are, there's a lot of like hidden mechanics that you can perfect. I like it. It, will, it uh, So the story of season one, which is right here, uh, Raptor save me, or whoever, whoever else, which is right after the main story, like the initial story, uh, it was like a living a living world, that's what it's called. It changed the world. And after it was done, it was impossible to replay. It happened like throughout a couple months, back in like 2013, I think. And... Jesus, I'm dying. Uh... Uh, they brought it back, like, I don't know when, like two years ago, I think? Go check. So yeah, uh, once I get to it, this will be my first playthrough of that, of that story. I've never touched it. I more or less know what happened because I like watched a YouTube video back in the day, but I didn't play it. But I agree, it, it is weird. Okay, uh, Raptor is in my party. Wait, I'm confused. It's not there. Here? I want to go over there. Let's speed up. There's people role-playing, he says. I mean, you check out the same. Now base game is free to play. Actually, role players, I love it. I'm, I'm, I'm also gonna like walk in.
I think we need to go here. Is it like a small jumping puzzle? Up here, Angra's Trove discovered. I think so. It's not a proper one. Oh, it's so pretty. Look, Ishako, there's no, there's no snow. Look at the crystals and greenery. Who the hell is Noxia? Why is she not vulnerable? Wait, what? Wait, what? Leave. Ah. Huh? I'm... I'm confused. And there's a portal. It's not the source of Raven's Shaman's power. The very air vibrates with energy. What can the cool? I know! That was very interesting. Interesting, and I didn't remember a single thing about it. Funny. Uh, we need one. Oh, there is a. It's an unearned hero point. Is it the last one? It is. Okay, let's just rush there, and then we're gonna do the story. Thirty seconds of swiftness now. Step. Oh, I'm gonna pick up the guard because I'm a nice person. Oh, um, Raptor, you're you're stinky, and I'm hot. Mm. Oh my god. I may be a chunky bird, but I'm still hot. I'll take it. Yeah, if if you EP, if you're tired, just just you, you can vibe and chat or something, or you can just go to sleep, whatever, and and get some rest. Yes, yes. Cut your hair on Wednesday. By how much? Oh, you don't have to even lurk here. If you're tired, just go to sleep. I sense a deep thirst inside you. Perhaps my ru my rum will ease it all. Oh my god, I want me some rum. I'm in a playful mood today. Answer me a riddle and I'll share with you. Speak me a riddle. What's sharper than the wolf's sharp sharpest teeth? Quicker than the quickest leopard? And more adaptable than a hibernating bear? Not a sword, you ram me wit. Wit? Well done! Okay, hey, give me your rum. You're level 31, and it's time for the story. I'm gonna focus. I don't really care for it. Oh! I have got an uh, a uh, uh, the, the thingy. Um, um, what's it called? An elite skill. That's bit. Wait, what is happening? Why are you? Oh, Reaper of Grant, use your ultimate. Training. And now we can summon an elemental. So let's summon get a rock. tank. Sweet. Okay, back to Holbrack. We're going to air and we're doing the story. I didn't ignore you, I... Oh, short. Oh my god, okay. Short. But short is not old. Hmm. Uh, Raptor, are you joining me for story or should I just go uh, do it by myself? Oh, he said it. Uh, and... and in game chat, do it by myself. Uh, oh, that's a good point. This level 30 is like a big 
Mm. Big switch in the story. We are moving away from like pure Norn story and like my own story, and we are like going out into the world. I wish I could give you more information, but I must return to Holbrook, speak with Air, she can tell you more about the orders. Okay. Oh my god, Air, thank you. Now I'm the hero. Garm! Wanna pet him? Okay, Air, what's up? What's going on? What was that all about? Scardy, son of Newt Whitebear and head of the Wolfborn, brings word of trouble in Holbrook. I was a son of I don't Newt? Understand. Did I hear you refuse to help? My time as a hero has come and gone. You're the hero that Holbrecht needs now. I will follow and advise you, of course, but this is your time and your challenge. Come, Scardy's waiting in Holbrecht and he needs help. He's meeting with some dignitaries who are very important, but hard to manage. What about her? Oh, that's my home instance. I wonder where it was. Oh. Um, uh, since I'm here... I will, I will gather what I have. Because this is, uh, this is a countdown stuff. And I uh, built some nodes back in the day that I can gather now daily. Oh, a hero challenge. Give me a hero point, sure. Um, uh, I need to clean it up. Uh. Is there anything we can actually use? Oh, there's a scepter. Kind of want a scepter, but this one's this one's ass. I want a good one. I will take it instead of a dagger that I have. Because I do want to have stab one hand and a scepter dagger in the other. Optimally. There we go. Um, go ahead destroy. Seven. This one, this one's actually still worse. Oh, I better try then. Okay, that's good enough. Slayer. Maybe uh, now we'll get some results. Vigil doesn't stand by when it's attacked. We strike back. At what? At the Priory, we collect information. And while you do the flailing and collecting, the Order of Whispers will be solving the problem. Order of Whispers, Priory, and the Vigil. Welcome, 
Slayer. I'd like you to meet representatives from the Vigil, the German Priory, and the Order of Whispers. They need your help. I'm honored. I'll do what I can, but first, I need to know more. What's the situation? Dredge activity is rising sharply up north. We've been finding dead bodies with horrific and inexplicable wounds. All three orders have an interest, so we need to combine our efforts. But we can't agree on a course of action. I'll let them elaborate. Okay. Welcome, Slayer. I'm Ifwin from the Order of Whispers. We specialize in covert activity. Information, infiltration, and assassination. We found the bodies, we reported the strange wounds, and we heard rumors of a dredge attack on Scholar's Cleft, a priory facility in that region. That complex is not well defended. Allow me to introduce myself. Scholar Prot of the German Priory. Scholar's Cleft is a place of learning. We're studying the Elder Dragons there, and that research is too important to fall into dredge hands. The Vigil has other priorities. I'm Crusader Thurkill. Marauding dredge of the problem? I say, no dredge, no problem. Done wrong. Those tunneling devils cost me a squad. I'll punish them for that, so they can't do more harm. Ever. So we have two objectives, two plans, but only one Slayer. That leaves the question, who gets your help? The dredge threat needs to be identified and contained. How will you begin? By protecting Scholar's Cleft? Or avenging the fallen Vigil Squad? Okay, I need to think from a perspective of a non-elementalist. Like, very spiritual. Uh, I, I think we need to, like, protect the, the Scholar's Cleft. Just like, she discovered it and they won't do anything. They want to save the place, and he just wants to smash things. Knowledge is the greatest Scholar's Cleft houses rare books and old tomes, uh, but there's nothing specially, specifically dredge related there. Will you come with me to make sure it's safe? I don't like it. I'd like to admit it, but we've had trouble containing the dredge. I have a unit standing by, but we could still use your help. Let's protect the knowledge. Yes, I want to know why the dredge are headed there. Splendid! The desire to learn is the key to wisdom. You'll be a huge asset on, on this mission. I hope so, and so let's get started. Who chooses sentry duty over taking the fight to the enemy? Someone thinking about the future. Your comrades are gone, but Scholar's Cleft can still be saved. Seriously. I approve of the Slayer's approach. This is bigger than frisky dredge with lost patrols. Maybe, but we have to start something. And the dread started this when they attacked the vigil. This guy is annoyed. Uh, I got an invisible bag, but I don't really need it. I think I'll actually destroy it. Yeah. Right. Can I TP from here? I can. I can't. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Until you do instance. Um, he's trying to drag Kira into Monster Hunter. Yo, Kim. Oh, it's the place with the three waypoints, right? Fine. Is there any raptor around? Nope. And seem to be. Looks like the R the RPRs. No stop roleplay guild. That sounds fun. Honestly. Like I've never roleplayed in, in Guild Wars, and I barely roleplayed in World of Warcraft. But that looks like fun. And thank and thanks to the fact that you can join multiple guilds, like six guilds simultaneously. Um I could do it. Fun. Okay. Hmm. Underground scholar. Hello, Prot. 
Glad to have you with us, Slayer. Scholar's Cleft is abuzz with rumors of an impending dredge attack. When I left, some of the faculty were convinced the attack was imminent. Studying dragons for so long makes one eager to confront a more manageable foe. If you don't mind, let's hurry before full-on panic sets in. I don't mind at all. If trouble's coming to Scholar's Cleft, I want to be there to meet it. Let's go. Oh. The dredge from the ground. Yeah. I always liked those tanks, like the, the, the drill tanks. Oh, who was that? Okay, we just need to smash things. And the Vigil Girl thought we would, we would not be fighting anything. Silly Vigil guy. Dredge APC, what does it stand for? APC armored, personal? C. Via chest love. What information? Actually, I've never done this instance before. I usually join the Order of Whispers on my characters. And do their stuff. Um, wait. Are there still tanks around? Oh, there are mortars. Okay. I like your new render outfit, the, the cowboy. <laughs> They're trespassing, teach the miners. I did. I just broke broke their toys. I won't allow harm to come to little Meowmers. Meowmers. Little Meowmers. Hello, Fiona. My cat, my poor Mr. Meowmers. Please keep her safe. She's all all the family I have left. But I thought you were the leader. Is the leader upstairs? Probably upstairs, okay. I'm being dumb. How much is the outfit? Kinda wanna buy it, I'm gonna lie. Kinda do. Okay, this building, it was not built for, for the Norn. Like, I can't jump here. Yep, I'm heading, yep. the six gods you arrived just in time the dredge have gone crazy we're here to help do you have any idea what those brutes wanted they were after a very specific book on ancient architecture their leader Vyacheslav fled with it just a moment ago oh, I don't know a book on architecture can dredge even read I don't know I told them where it was and they left me alive my poor colleagues if the dredge got what they wanted I doubt they'll be back Tend to the wounded, Scholar. The Slayer and I will deal with the dredge. I need to report this to my superiors of the Priory Slayer. I'll meet you back in Holbrek when I'm finished, and then we'll speak to the others. Okay. Oh, I'm going back to Holbrek. Do you have a question? So many dead, and over a book we've... we'd have shared if they'd asked. Thank you for the help. You saved our lives. Okay. Okay. 
I'm here just to wave bye bye to Mr. Meowmers. Bye bye. It actually was. There were merchants. Was it also called. Um, what, what is it? Scholars Collect? Huh. I love all the GW1 re references. Nope. Okay. What was it called? Raggle's Keep. I, I don't remember that name. It was probably an obscure Eye of the North outpost, right? Be better to steal the weapon. Learn oh, you're true. You're true. You're right. Defense. If it's especially lethal, we might even want to turn it against the dragons themselves. Ads in four. No. Okay, let's finish this conversation, and I will run the ads while I run to to the next story. Thank you, Max. So it was the prophecies area, right? In that case. The rumors were true. Dredge did attack Scholar's Cleft. They killed a lot of people and stole an ancient tome. They were led by a Dredge named Vyacheslav. Vyacheslav. His orders. They murdered my colleagues for a book about architecture. Why? What was in the book that would be worth killing and dying for? Does it matter? I'm here to report that the Vigil just lost another squad to yes. this mystery weapon. It matters. The Dredge and their new toy must be stopped. I think we all agree on that. But the Priory isn't going to charge in without more information. Then stand aside. We know they're keeping the weapon somewhere near Molenhide. We'll fight our way in and destroy it. Or we could sneak in and steal it. By the time the Dredge build another one, we'll have a response prepared. As long as we do something now to prevent more loss of life. What say you, Slayer? Steal the weapon or destroy it? I'm actually gonna let you guys decide what we should do, because I don't particularly mind any of those paths. Should we go with the Order of Whispers and steal the weapon, or with the Vigil and just storm in and destroy everything? Okay, let's do the Order of Whispers in that case. Hello. The Vigil would throw bodies at this problem and waste lives. With a subterfuge, I have planned what we need falls into what we need falls into our hands. I agree. We should achieve our goal quickly, quietly, and efficiently. I think out of those two, my character would choose also choose the Order of Whispers. Oh, I actually got a scepter. Noise. Right, I'm gonna run ads now, change my equipment, and go to the next place. I'll have to learn how to use the scepter. <laughs> I don't remember. It's so funny. It's so funny. So what do we have? We have Flame Strike. We have Dragon's Tooth, but I, yeah, which is a Dragon's Tooth. We have a Phoenix that comes back to us, and I think heals us. Heals damage, explodes. Doesn't heal us, gives us vigor, which gives us more dodge. And with a dagger, I can create a ring of fire for like explosions and stuff. Time. Here we have eye shards. Shatter stone. Does damage and chill. Cool, cool, cool. What a trident. This is a heal. 
Deals more damage to a chilled foe, so I always want to do Shatterstone and then Trident. This is a heal. Okay. Here we have just Palpatine Electricity, Lightning Strike, does damage to vulnerability, blindness here. Got that. And Earth has Stone Shards with Bleed, a Rock Barrier. Oh, wait, what? I can't remember that. And we can throw the rocks at people. Okay, cool. Does level for blindness. An earthquake. And a leap with a lot of bleed. Gotcha. I'll be fine. Where are we going? Uh, over there. That was a cool dash. It's Molengrad, Ivan, what else? They're not even hiding it. They're not trying to hide it. What do you mean this dash? Yeah. I'm gonna be using the scepter a lot, and I think you'll like it. you especially like this. It's shorter range than the stuff, but I can just sub them. And even the water thing deals a decent amount of damage. With the Shattered Stone and Water Trident combo. Wait, how much was that? It was... Shattered Stone, boom, boom. Yeah. You want to play this game just to dash like that? You can. You can read and do the stuff I do. Because all of the Corteria, which is basically the entire main story that we're doing it's free okay are the ads over they are let's steal the thingy the dredge hideout agent if one Okay, Slayer. You're good at what you do, but now we see if you're good at what I do. The Order of Whispers doesn't shrink from violence, but we try to keep it to the necessary minimum. And in our line of work, it's often necessary. The Dredge have sealed themselves inside that mine. We need to get in, take what we need, and get out. I propose we borrow a pair of their mining suits. They'll assume we're one of them and let us in. After that, we have to improvise. Sneak in and keep a low profile until violence is necessary. I can handle that. Should we mine some ore first to help sell the disguise? Now you're thinking like one of us. I predict a bright future for you in our order. If you can mine as well as a dredge, that is. We'll have you fighting dragons in no time. That's in our charter, you know. But until then, let's put on a show and dig our way into that mine. And do that, Rapture. Uh, okay. Put on the dredge disguise, which is over there. Drill the rocks, and the dredge will come pick up the ore. Have a slush and a panel. So dredge. All problems can be solved through unity. Panel. Noise. Nice work. Oh, one more. The hell is that outfit? It's like their gathering tank, you know? Be proud! You collected for the collective! The collective, yeah, they're not trying to hide it, Raptor. <laughs> Uh, the communism is real in this one. A 
When's your daughter? There we go. Now to get what we came for. Search for the dread weapon. Weapon crate. Okay, nothing. Don't be suspicious, don't be suspicious. Don't be suspicious, don't be suspicious. I, they are comrades, yeah. Oh. Remember when I said we would improvise? <laughs> Now's the time. We don't need a whole prototype. The components in this box will tell us all we need to know. And look oh around. What the f Some of these parts are far too big for the weapon I saw. The dredge must be planning to build an even larger version. With a weapon that size, they could yeah. shoot through a small mountain. With you that a size. Building, a building what? makes more sense. The dredge stole a book about ancient architecture from the priory. They must be preparing to take out a large structure. Well spotted. This weaponsmith Vyashislav sounds madder all the time, even for a dredge. Let's take what we've learned back to the others and figure out where the dredge will strike. Why are you so big? Happened. Um. Uh... Bail out, Slayer. There's something wrong with your suit. It's smoking. Oh. Oh, that's. Oh, that's unlucky. Way more. There you go. Oh, okay. Why, why did you stop? Sweet. What happened back there? The mining suit was working perfectly and then it completely broke down. Hard to say. Between your size and unfamiliarity with the controls, I expect you taxed its systems past the break. Oh, so it's my fault. Hardly your fault. Oh, okay. Course. Dredge machinery is powerful, but it's not as reliable as the Chars, or as flexible as the Asuras. Vyacheslav's machinery seems reliable enough, especially since he keeps upgrading it. We need to identify his target before he perfects his weapon. Agreed. I'll meet you back in Holbrek, and we'll confer with the others. Maybe they can help us determine which huge building is in danger. Nice work, by the way. I renew my offer. When you're ready to join the fight against the dragons, the Order of Whispers would be glad to have you. Let's go back to Holbrek. I think there are only like two more instances left. I may be very wrong. Also, what's the next zone we should be doing? Oh, it's Lorner's Pass, 25 to 40. Right. And I think we might be going there right now. Would make sense. The story is for level 30, and we've so far we've only been in zones uh, up to level 25. I could also go to the Gandaran fields, yes. I probably just go to. Wait, why is it still on? I, I thought I gathered it. There we go. I'll just go to where the story is me. Oh wait, wait, wait. We can do some, uh, some of the, you know, training. Um, uh, or not. 
I should probably just unlock all the skills first, right? And then do the training. Yeah, because this icon is going to annoy me. Seriously annoy me. Hello. No, it's just power. The dredge are definitely building another weapon. One big enough to shatter a mountain. I've seen the proof with my own eyes. Given the architectural tome they stole, I think Vyacheslav's target is a large building. But which one? Where is he going to strike? True. But a little research might get us that information. My contacts have intercepted a coded dredge message. I suspect it was being sent to Molengrad. If we break the code, we can figure out what the dredge are planning. We haven't got time for the Priory to crack that code. I have a spy inside a dredge settlement. Let's ask him for the information. I'll leave the intelligence gathering to you, Lot. Vigil is ready to move on whatever you discover. In the meantime, we'll keep hunting Vyacheslav. We'll share what we learn with the Vigil. But first the Slayer must decide how we're going to learn it. By breaking the code or debriefing the spy. The complex code and rather old. I wouldn't have thought that Dredge capable of understanding it, much less creating it. I'm with you, Prot. Anything that uh, they can code, we can crack. More. How can I help? Ah, you must be the Slayer. Scholar Prot said you were interested in this coded letter we discovered. That's right. The dredge who sent it had been preparing a new weapon for something big. We need to know what so we can stop it. It's a book cipher. The sender and the recipient both refer to the same published work. Every letter in the code corresponds to a word in the book. This sequence at the end tells you the page and line you want. 029701 means page 297, line 1. I see. And then we use the numbers to assemble the words in the message. One sec. But how do we know what book was used to encode it? Well, that's the tricky part. It could be anything that's ever been published. That's why this code type is informally known as security by obscurity. The only sure way is to find the sender or recipient and see what book they're using. This letter came from Molenhide. If I were you, I'd start there. Okay, find a book used to encode the dredge message. Hello, prop. To crack the code, we need to find a book the dredge are using as their cipher key. Right, uh, are we sure it's here? The message originated here. Mm. Odds are it was encoded here. They have no idea we're onto them. Uh, so the book could even be in plain sight. Okay, let's go and find it then. And it's over there. Good, we have an ultimate kind of pyramental. Okay, it should be somewhere around here. Kill the enemy. Yep. Spy Master Golosk. Under the Valley of the Lily. The book is extremely worn, ink smudges the, uh, the cover 
binding and pages. Thumb through the book. The book is a bodice ripping tale of adventure and romance featuring Lily Boyer, the young, brash, and beautiful daughter of the cruel, disfigured Senator Alexander Boyer. The story follows Lily as she runs away from home twice, joins a band of savage pirates, and takes on a no less than three different men and women as and women as lovers. Page two nine seven is especially dog eared. Oh. L Lily reeled as she gazed into the pirate queen's bottomless amber eyes. Butterflies fluttered in her stomach that had not taken wings since the first time she kissed Victor, you mean, or Sadi Rod. <laughs> Do you have mana or only cooldowns? It's only cooldown. There is no mana in this game. Certain certain classes, certain specializations have like a different resource, or rather a mechanic. Like my mechanic is the the switching of the attunements, the, the elements. But no, there's no mana. Okay, the decoded message reads: Vladok, weapon not ready. Return to Underberg. The decoded message reads, Vladok weapon ready, target is blind, wait at Underberg. The decoded message reads, Vladok weapon ready, but the target is awake, wait at Moldavia. I'm confused, and I think I wasn't really paying attention. I'm, um, hmm. That is the first one. Okay, the decoded message is nonsense. <laughs> Um. Okay, not taking wins, so probably something is not. But that was the not option. Okay, weapon ready, target is blind, weighted underberg. I am so smart. <laughs> I forget what I did. We've cracked it. The weapon is an underberg near Lornar's Pass. Good work. The Priory employs many fine scholars and many bold adventurers, but it's rare we find both in one package. I sincerely hope you're considering joining us. Thank you. Time. Thank you, Max. The dragons grow stronger every day, and the Priory needs more members like you. I'm considering it, but we should get to Underberg. This may be our last chance to stop Vyacheslav's weapon. Wait, I want to know how to actually do it, because I did it on, like, at random. What's it called? It's. That's it, the weapon is an underberg, okay. It's Codebreaker. Um, one second, I'm actually gonna Google it. Oh. Okay, that's kind of stupid. There's a lore discrepancy, and apparently it's impossible for the player character to decipher the message with the information available. I'm just gonna pretend we are smart and move on. Uh, that's the end of the, of the zone, right? I can I can leave. Okay, I think I can. That's interesting. Never really done this particular mission before. Uh, I need mean to go to Lorna's Pass. Yeah. And the scepter is super, super bursty. I like it. And if I remember correctly, Lornar's Pass is where the Priory has uh, uh, their headquarters. Elementalist. Like most classes can swap weapons in combat and it just goes on cooldown. But Elementalists originally couldn't use more than one set of weapons. Then they added the ability to switch, but it's only off uh, out of combat. Because we have like attunements, so we gain more abilities. We have more abilities than any other class anyway. Uh, okay. 
Scholar plot. plot. Scholar plot. This is the place, but it's total chaos inside. There are ice dragon minions everywhere. So are the dredge under attack? Wait. Why is he running away? Well, he just died. I'll take it. Hold, Slayer. Let's hear what the dredge are saying. I think I just killed him. I've had enough of your insolence and your cowardice. The people demand vengeance, and Vyacheslav has provided the means. But Vyacheslav is insane. Can't you see that? His weapon is as dangerous to us as it is to his target. His thirst for revenge will doom us all. Vyacheslav is a genius, and his weapon will crush the last of the dwarf oppressors. The revolution will finally be complete. Dwarf oppressors? At what cost? The last dwarf is protected by the Dermond Priory. Oh. Taking his life is not worth war with one of the most powerful orders in Tyria. Enough! I declare you an enemy of the people and a traitor to the cause. The penalty is death. Rise, brothers and sisters, and kill this turncoat. No, don't kill him. He's a nice one. I'd say we've seen enough. Let's save that dissenter. He may be able to help us. Precisely. And boink. <laughs> Blind him. I love the machine gun stone. Thank you for saving me. I can't believe my own comrades turned on me so viciously. If you're truly grateful, tell me about Vyacheslav's weapon. I would not lightly betray the Molotariat. Molotariat? Vyacheslav is insane. I'll tell you all I know. Vyacheslav calls it the Mark III Sonic Vaporizer. It uses the recorded cries of a captive ice dragon minion, subsonically amplified so that the vibration crushes stone the last dwarf oppressor ogden stone healer is hiding inside the dermond prior itself generations of enslaved dredge demand his death ogden had nothing to do with oppressing your people his skills and knowledge make him a valuable member of the dermond priory and vyacheslav wants him dead the problem is the sonic vaporizer attracts dragon minions whenever it's fired and Ogden's inside the Dermon Priory itself. You were right, Prot. Vyacheslav's target is going to face dragon minions as well as the dredge weapon. The Priory must be defended. We'll need all the help we can get. Quickly, we must return to Holbrek and confer with the others. Okay, thank you, Vladok. Hello, comrades. Hello. Bye-bye. <laughs> <laughs> So there is the last dwarf hidden inside a Dermon Priory. I'm gonna lie, it's a very important lore bit and I completely forgot about it. Ogden Stone Healer, the last dwarf, uh, was a companion in, uh, in Guild Wars 1. I wish dwarves were real. <laughs> they are a figment of our imagination. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I know. I know you mean playable. We've got to act quickly. Vyacheslav is targeting the Dermond Priory itself in an effort to kill Ogden Stonehealer. 
What's worse, the weapon's sonic beam is based on the cries of dragon minions. The sound it makes will attract every dragon minion in the region. Sounds simple enough. We know where they're going. We can meet them head on and destroy the weapon before they fire it. That's how the vigil handles those who kill our soldiers and trifle with dragons. Vyacheslav and all who stand with him must die. I agree. But the Order of Whispers has a subtler solution. The Slayer and I will use stealth magic to get close to Vyacheslav. We can kill him without engaging all the dredge forces. Without their leader, they'll collapse into chaos. Excuse me. The Priory's main facility is entirely capable of defending itself. We have access to ancient and powerful magic. Specifically, we have a silencing ritual that will completely baffle Vyacheslav's sonic weapon. No sound, no attack, and no Lord Dragon minions. Tough choices, Slayer, but clear ones. But before you make your decision, you should understand how important this choice is. Each of the Orders would be honored to have you join. If you agree, the Order you choose to help now will accept you into its ranks permanently. That will put you in a position to join their fight against the Elder Dragons. I, for one, can think of no better path for a hero to take. Agreed. I'm ready to confront the most dangerous threat Tyria has ever faced, and I'll need allies to do it. Give me a moment to consider, and then I'll choose. And then I'll choose. <laughs> <laughs> that bug was funny. Okay, so now we're actually choosing the the order, and even though I personally I like the subterfuge and I would have just killed the leader. I am going to go with Skull to join the Priory, and we're going to use the Silencing spell to just render the weapon completely useless. And he's and he just still wants to just smash things, as you know, as they do. Once you see the Priory in all its glory, you'll be persuaded to join our cause. With your keen mind, you'd be a tremendous asset. Tell me more about the Derman Priory. We explore, we study, we learn. Each new discovery makes us hunt for more. From ancient tombs to mystic portals, nothing is beyond reach. If you are a trailblazer like trailblazer like If you are a trailblazer, join us. Like what? Okay, uh, let's just read all of those. Tell me more about the vigil. Our mission is to protect the innocent by crushing threats with overwhelming force. We don't do subtle, we don't do nuance. We strike hard, we strike fast, we get results. Yeah, sounds about right. And the Order of Whispers. Tell me more about the Order. We pride ourselves on focus and efficiency. We don't smash through a wall. We identify and remove the one brick that makes the wall collapse. If that sounds appealing, your choice is clear. Okay, we are... I'm ready to join. And the Durman Priory is definitely the place for me. And I, I agree. It's funny, most of my characters... Uh... Join the Order of Whispers. I mean, I have a Mesmer, and Mesmers are like the, the tricksters, so they join the Order of Whispers. I honestly cannot remember who my Necromancer originally joined, and I would have to check it in his journal. I think he also joined the Order of Whispers, but I may be wrong. The Dermond Priory yeah, shall stand maybe. ready for this assault and turn the Dredge's own cleverness against them. With you at our side, we cannot fail. I can't wait to see this fascinating ancient ritual you mentioned. I'll meet you at the gathering point. The ritual is one part of our response. You are the other. This is how the Priory operates. How we succeed. By combining wisdom with action. Once we've defeated the Dredge and the Dragon Minions they summon, we can begin the hard work of confronting the Elder Dragons themselves. You've chosen well, Slayer. I look forward to seeing the great things you will do with the Priory. I am proud to have found the hero Tyria needs. I love her. I will join you for the defense of the Priory. Until Hell yeah. then and forever after. May the spirits of the wild walk with you. Um... Mine is better. Oh, but that's an upgrade. I'm taking this dagger. Uh, equipment. There we go. 
It's funny, out of all the races, I, I was trying, like yesterday, I was trying to figure out who I like the most out of the, like, main, hmm, not leaders, guides, like Air. And I don't know, I like all of them. They're just great. Yeah, every single one, I, I don't have favorites. Mm -hmm. Okay, so back to... Back to Lornar's Pass. Oh wait, no, that's Kandaran Fields. Oh, I don't think I discovered any Lornar's Pass waypoint. Oh, that, that's unlucky. It's nice how guilds are so many with each, with each other. You mean that the orders? I mean, yeah, they have completely different met uh, methods, so it makes sense. Like, Oh no, I, there's a waypoint. I think together they are the strongest. Okay, this is them. Okay, yeah, that's the Priory. Their headquarters. Level up. <laughs> I'm a character without the outfits. The, the outfit is so scuffed. I kind of love it. So funny. He's he, is it? It's not Steve. We call him Jack. What was his name? I don't remember. Raptor. Silent Warfare. I'm pretty sure this is the last part of the story. Let's do it. I really like this spell. <laughs> Garm! An Ogden Stone Healer. Look at that dwarf. I am very glad to have to have you among the Priory's ranks. And not just because you saved me. I haven't yet. The, dr the dreadest old grudge against my people is precisely the kind of division the dragons will exploit. How did you outlo outlive the rest of your kind? I didn't. The few survivors now battle servants of the Elden Dragon Primordis deep underground. I alone remain above to tell the tale. That's a very long cooldown. True, but we have like plenty of other skills to use for movement, you know? <laughs> What's up there? I thought I'd done all I could for Tyria. You've taught me that any blade, even reforged, can make a difference. And you've taught me where and how to make that difference. We complement each other. Garm aside, it's been too long since I've been part of a functioning team. Thank you, Slayer. It's good to rely on someone and to be relied on again. We'll get lots of practice. Teamwork's the only way to defeat the dragons. Black wing of Raven hangs heavy over the Priory today. The dredge Vyacheslav abandons reason. He threatens to topple the entire Priory if we continue protecting Ogden. The screams of that weapon will flood this place with dragon minions. We have to stop it. Our scholars have prepared the ritual of silencing. We've never used it before, but we have our finest minds on it. If successful, it will silence the Sonic Vaporizer and give us the edge to counterattack with our limited forces. However, the ritual will take time. We need you to protect the Ritualists until it is complete, and then lead the assault against the Dredge. It's a difficult task. It is sick. And... The Slayer of Isormir excels at difficult tasks. I, I do. I do. Air, it's me. You did come. It means a lot that you'd fight at my side today. Ogden is an old friend. Thanks to you, I've been reminded that no matter how bad things seem, heroes don't give up on their friends. I will stay behind to guard Ogden while you and the Priory take the lead. Speaking of my old friend... Air! Prot! And you must be the Slayer of Isormir. I am Ogden Stonehealer. Thank you for defending the Priory and my life. The ritual casters are ready. I'll act as head ritualist. Let me know when you are ready and we will begin. Alright, I had a quick question, like, for M. Why didn't he tell us that this is the first time they're gonna activate the spell? Like, maybe I wouldn't have joined the Priory if I'd know that. Huh? I kind of feel scammed, I'm not gonna lie. What if it doesn't work? Okay. 
Well, I guess too late now. I got scammed. Now he's just running away. Members of the oh, God. Priory. We are not here for your lives. Send him forth. Resist, and the howl of our guns shall wake I didn't see the attack. Oh, I can't attack attack. No, I can. Yay. What was that attack? I didn't know this one. Oh. How's your frost or a true to explode healing and damaging allies? Oh, that's cool. Shield. Boink. Hey, halfway there. I should probably have my elemental out. I, I will always forget about that. them too quickly. Oh well. The quest is moving forward, I suppose. Dump. Boink. <laughs> Wait, is there not going to be any other wave of enemies? I guess our job is to protect him, so we can just stay here. We are doing our job. And he sits. <laughs> Lead the counterattack and kill Vyacheslav. Alright. Oh my god. Oh my god. Well, that's not ideal. My sound. That's weird. What happened to the sounds? Why is it so muted? Oh, the silence spell. You are so smart. I am actually an idiot, obviously. Yes. That's the... That's the silence spell. Oh, I feel so dumb right now. Oh... <laughs> uh... Thank you, Max. Yeah. Hey, we did it! Why 
Are you just tired or injured? Become bot. Oh, that was quick. You made all the difference, Slayer. The Priory would not have survived that attack without your help. You people in Tyria truly understand how great a threat the Elder Dragons are to all of us. But we who do are preparing to stop them. It's been a pleasure working alongside you, Slayer. But now you're expected in Lion's Arch. Really is. A Priory mentor has been assigned to you and will be standing by. They'll help you settle in and adjust to your new duties. Okay. Thank you, Prot. And what about you, Air? What is your future hold? I am also headed for Lion's Arch. I'm meeting one of my former comrades from Destiny's Edge. We used to fight dragons together. I've heard of them. In Holbrook, they still sing songs of their brave deeds. You took down a dragon lieutenant together, didn't you? In simpler times, yes. We disbanded. But now I see that we, I, have more to do. You helped teach me that, and I will always be grateful. After all you've taught me, it's only fair that I return the favor. Farewell, Air. I hope to see you again someday. We did it! Uh... Oh, we got some yellow gear. Um. Let's equip that. Thank you so much for watching the video. Make sure to like and subscribe and check me out on twitch.tv slash itsasgar. See you in the next one.